0-0 in 9-1 in the second two games of the series. 2-2 two, two pitch. Strike three call. Inside corner, Rodriguez goes down looking. Two outs in the first. Mississippi College junior Brooks Fortenberry has been a force for the Choctaws on the mound. In 61 innings of work, the Friday night starter has 56 strikeouts. No one knows Fortenberry better than his catcher, Zach Evans. He's been really productive this season. Uh, gotten ahead a lot with his fastball and located his breaking stuff well. That way, later in the game, we can, we can throw his breaking stuff and it looks a lot, it looks a lot harder to hit. If I go off speed early in the count, I'm going to try to elevate the fastball, try to go high fastball. If I fed him a couple fastballs, most of the time I'll go split. But early in the season, I couldn't throw the slider good. Recently, I've been able to throw the slider for a strike. I've been going to that a lot. Fortenberry carries a 2.05 ERA and has pitched four complete games in his eight starts. The main thing for me would have been pitch count. Early in the season, I was getting close to 100 pitches, five or six. I was falling behind guys, and recently I've uh, been working ahead, so I've been able to spread those pitches out. I threw 100 today, but more feels fine because we spread it out and start the guys off with strikes. It feels good to keep, keep up with an attack for the rest of the weekend. Evans, who was raised near Fortenberry in McGee, says he is just as good off the field. He's a good guy. He's a leader on the team. He kind of keeps everybody, keeps it up, beating the locker room and stuff. For a relaxed bunch of guys, a bunch of friendly guys. This has been the most close knit team I've ever been on, high school and now. And it's a bunch of great guys. You don't have to worry about somebody uh, getting out of line or having a bad attitude. We've got a really bunch of good guys on the team. With the Choctaws, I'm Andy O'Brien.